Good morning guys! I'm right now in Frankfurt, freezing my ass off while riding into the city itself, wearing a nice suit, being totally gentleman-like, or at least I try. And I'm off to the Distinguished Gentleman's Ride, a charity ride, a worldwide event for men's health, like prostate cancer and uh, mental health and all issues regarding manly health stuff. I think it, like 220 or something like this other riders uh, are here at the event in Frankfurt like over a lot, a really fucking lot uh, people worldwide so six in Kenya seven in Liechtenstein to a few thousand, like eight thousand in Italy and six thousand in Canada and so all over the world and uh, we're doing a ride through the city on all the uh, kind of all vintage and old bikes that we possess, we as the riders riding. And since I'm owner of an old, or let's say right now a little bit crappy old bike, I decided to join. So I traveled yesterday from Kassel to Frankfurt on this bike at the Autobahn. Sounds funny, wasn't really wasn't <laughs> this bike is not for high speeds and uh, even if I just got it out of the garage the indicators and the horn stopped working and I couldn't figure it out yesterday what, uh, what the issue was or is anyhow I hope I get some cool pictures for you from old bikes So, when we're here, as was a bit sound funny, I used to lie out on the beach, close my eyes, may there be a pretty girl lying on the sand next to me.
So guys, we are starting. I hope you can hear something of the roaring and ribbing. We have bikes like from the 30s, 20s, 30s, 40s, up to more recent models, especially from Triumph. Have a lot of coffee racers and, <laughs> and builds. And this will be so fucking loud. We are 274 bikers. I joined the older ones. Since I have one of the less powerful bikes. Off we go. At least a few. <laughs> That's quite cool to. Oh man, I, I see the, the group in front there, like to the light after the next. A lot of people filming. So I guess I'm linking everything I can get in the description below. Yeah, and I'm trying to get some room to the Harley, it's just too fucking loud. <laughs> yeah, it's getting warm. to drive along in my hometown with a lot of other bikers and mostly bikers that don't just buy a, a fully redesigned bike but more or less like building it itself oh man I'm so stoked on building this thing to something more cool. I think it's a, it's a good idea to do the, the makeover of the CB until next September for the next ride. Or at least I'll try that. And A lot of, of history between these bikes. That doesn't matter what the or the uh, the producing company is. You see a lot of similar parts and similar designs in the different time epochs. So we now we are making a short break at the open platz in front of the old theater, the old opera, and have a look around.
Oh look guys, the cops are blocking the road for us. That's nice. A lot of publicity, so to speak. They're playing different operas in the opera house uh, right now. So a lot of old and well-dressed people <laughs> came out and were wondering what all these dirty and loud, noisy bikes are doing there with people in nice clothes. So we're all gentlemen, you see. <laughs> That's was <what's> funny. <laughs> yeah. What would you do when you have to wait on light? You vape, right. A cool bike, anyway. <laughs> Did you see that guy? He just swapped the beer from under his seat into his pocket. I mean, you got a drink, right? We're leaving the Walter Kronplatz and uh, off to we're off to, to uh, and we have to get some some meat grilled meat I hope or at least a ho alcoholic free beer or something like this. I don't know what actually will happen. I'll take you along as long as my batteries or the batteries of the GoPro are working. And I hope you enjoyed some nice pictures of old bikes. Maybe you think about joining the ride next year. There is, I think, a ride next to you somewhere in the world. 
just check the, the homepage, I'll link it below in the description. And so uh, yeah, maybe I'll see you next year.